What's up? Another day, another training, and today is bodyweight day. Me versus me. I'll be doing my own workout on YouTube, right? And today's session will last about almost one hour. Okay, so before you get freaked out, if you are new to training, if you want to try, you want to follow today's session, here's the thing. Follow the first three rounds. Only the first three rounds for beginners. Only the first three rounds for you. Intermediate, try to keep up with me at least halfway of this workout. That means maybe 30 minutes of today's workout. Okay? And for those of you, intermediate or advanced, pretty expert, pretty fit, or you just feel like, you know, the day that you want to push yourself a little bit more, try to keep up with me for this entire session. Okay, so before I get started, I just want to say thank you very much for all the birthday wishes. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I had a great one, and as you can see here, I'm not shirtless because uh, still uh, resting, right? And also giving a little bit different feeling instead of always being shirtless here. Okay, so this session is about working out. It's not about talking, all right? And what else I want to say? This is a two-way thing. It's not just me giving you workout, but in return, your presence here, your view here, doing with me, sitting back watching, enjoying your dinner, supports me too. And if you want to support this channel, you think that it's helpful, you can always send stars or just share it up. Okay, so I'm going to get started, watch and follow or just sit back and enjoy. It's going to be one hour long, right? And this session will burn up to almost 700 calories to 800 calories for my level, I mean for heart level, right? Beginners, you want to follow along, right? Take it easy. I said first three rounds for beginners, halfway for intermediate or at once level, follow all the way. It's not going to be easy. It's going to be tough. Ready? Warm up. Let's go. Excited and a little bit nervous because today is uh, not easy. Yeah? It's going to be double of this kind of workout. Right? Let's go. Five, four, push up. Two, 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 one, go. Go! 
Okay, so that's the warm up. That's the warm up, right? Obviously, it's me versus me. And if you want to versus me, be careful. Make sure you do it with good form. And if for beginners, you want to take this challenge, follow the first three rounds only for beginners. I do not recommend you to follow more than that because uh, you need to recover and you don't want to get the risk of injured, getting injuries, right? So beginners, first three rounds for you. Intermediate, try to keep up halfway with me. That means 20 minutes with me. At once, or people like been training for quite some time, you want to burn fat, you want to get stronger, or you want to take the challenge, follow me, entire workout. It's going to be one hour long, yeah? So we are still super early and we haven't even started yet. All right, get ready. Round number one. Ready? Have your water ready? Not ready yet? I'm going to start now, all right? I'm going to start now and let's go. Okay, round one. Push up. Go. Shoulders one by one. Don't rotate your body. Go. Yeah. Probably the first burpee of the entire day, right? First, but not last. Go. going to get harder and harder okay so don't overestimate yourself recover and I wish you good luck right so we'll be starting in the next minute one minute rest have your water have a sip of dew and round two starting in the next minute see you soon ah my stomach I'm still feeling the spiciness because I had a lot of spicy food yesterday uh, and 
one hour ago, I actually had some a little bit of spicy food, so it's burning here. <laughs> so lesson learned, please don't eat anything spicy before your, your workout. If not, you will really feel it. <laughs> okay. Ready, round two. Beginners round two, second last round for you. And maybe you can decide whether you want to carry on or not after round three. Yeah, beginners, please stay until round three. Okay, it's a hard one. If you can't do a push up, just do this, right? Go! level beginners right so hints round three is going to be challenging much more challenging than round two so I'm giving you guys longer break make sure you survive round three you survive round three is good enough for you whether or not you want to carry on round four or five is up to you okay on my fan because the my AC alone is not enough uh, yeah maybe I should take off my shirt but I find that hey today is not the right right day to take off shirt maybe the second half of this stream I will take off my shirt okay so we are still early round three is going to be challenging round three is like no rest the rest 
will be your active reps. That means instead of rest, we'll be doing jumping jacks, run in place, active recovery, burn fat, stamina, and fitness level. All right, round three. Time is almost up. Three, two, one, let's go. Jumping jacks, man. Jumping jacks. Jumping jacks. Now, no rest. Jumping jacks is your rest. Last round for beginners. Round three. Ready? Jumping lunges next. Next, let's try. One by one. I'm so sorry. I mean, ladies and gentlemen, because a lot of uh, strong ladies here are doing with me. All right, so we are round three, and beginners, well done. That's for you. It's about 15, 15 minutes, and if you want to carry on, you can try round four. But well, I say round four onwards, round three onwards is, is going to be like this non stop. Okay, so we have round four, and we have round five, if not wrong. Yeah. And after this, it's halfway. Okay, so it's a long one. It's a tough one. As you can see, my sweat. Ooh, all wet. Uh, looking almost transparent. Uh, this look kind of remind me a bit of like a Captain America. <laughs> Captain Malaysia. Captain Malaysia. Okay, longer break from now. You deserve it. Longer break before you go to four. round four, right? Round four is challenging. Round five is challenging. My stomach is still burning from the food. 
not the fat burning, but the food still digesting. No complaint, carry on. Less thinking, more doing. The more I think, the more I will find excuses and the more I won't do it. Round four. Let's go. Intermediate level. Please keep up with me, all right? Now, round four. Okay, bodyweight squat, sing. Ready? Let's go. Go. Firing up the legs. Remember, no rest. After this, it's run in place, yeah? After squat, is a run in place. When the sound. Two, one, run. Next, next. Keep running. Up next, push up, get ready. And push up, next. Jumping jacks, next. Jumping jacks. Jump lunges, next. Now, feel the burn. Burpees next, right? In four seconds, burpees. Let's go, next. Jumping jacks next. Next, jacks. So close. Finishing soon. Go round four. Keep breathing. Running plan. Let's go. Running plan. Next. Fast exercise. Keep going. After this, we have long break. Yeah. I'm loving it. Okay, let's take about two to three minutes break and then we are final round for the first half. Yes, this is the only first half. For intermediate, final round for you and who knows? Feel free to carry on. Listen to your body. Oh man. One thing good about wearing shirts working out is uh, it absorbs the sweat but it doesn't really feel comfortable because it's like sweaty or sticked up. <laughs> okay, so it's like, you know, as a workout presenter, this is kind of like my outfit. Wearing shirt is also like my outfit. 
Although my standard outfit is shirtless, but wearing shirt is like different outfit. Okay. <laughs> One more round. Final round for the first half. And then we will move on to the second half. Alright, ready? You got this. Just slow down the pace. Complete with me. As long as you do it with good form, yeah? Remember, forms always come first if you're, if you're wondering which is more important. The number of reps, keeping up with Jordan Yo, or maintain your form. Which one is the most important? Maintaining a good form is the most important. In other words, you might do it slower than me, or super slow, or almost like not moving at all, as long as you maintain a good straight, good posture, squatting straight, and when you run, make sure you land soft, right, upright, breathe, Okay, breathing, maintain breathing, that's what we talk about, good form. Push-ups, all the way down, all the way up. If you can't do this, just drop your knees, maintain a parallel straight back control form. That is the most important. Round five, let's go. Okay, this is gonna be tough.
keep running, don't think, just move. And then that's the end of the workout. Go! Five rounds. Five rounds of uh, progressive body weight. I call this progressive is because we started easy and then slowly and slowly and slowly bringing up the intensity, bringing up the movement. Woo, to the sweat. Look at my sweat. Whoa. This is white. This is pure white at first. But now it's, it's transparent. <laughs> okay, so good job for those of you beginners, intermediate, up until here. And this is only halfway for me. Okay, so I'll be doing another workout. So maybe for those of you who just can come in, right? You can you can just follow the second half, which I'm about to do. The second half half itself is like level four, but really level four. Okay, if you do it fast, it's level five. Right, so taking a break, a little bit longer break there for, for me to recover. All right. Okay, so the second half, we'll be doing my latest workout video in my YouTube. It's level four and level five. So if you manage to do it fast, it's level five. If you do it steady, like I'm about to do steady, it's going to be level four. It's a lot of legs. It's not going to be easy. Okay, so we're starting in the next minute, right? So get ready.
And look at my sweat.
there's a lot of legs, right? Oh, a lot of legs, a lot of cardio. You still have two more rounds, and if you really push out, this is level five. Okay, but obviously I'm taking more like steady pace. It's about level four, or level 4.5. Right, so three minute rest, because other than recovering your heart rate, our legs deserve more rest because upcoming is a lot of legs, a lot of legs work. Stay strong. Second last set of this entire workout. It's a hard one, and I believe you can make it through. I believe in you. Almost there. 31 seconds, and we'll be doing round two, second half. Round two of the second half. Okay, time's up. Let's go.
Go. Here. This one by one. You should feel your legs burning. They are growing stronger every rep. Remember that. You are getting stronger rep by rep. Next. Right. Crunches. Lie down. Reach your heel. Go. One more, one more round. Oh my god, uh, it's almost an hour of workout. Oh man, I have. I'm really sorry I have to go shirtless because it's like soaking wet. Oh. Don't worry, I'll clean my floor. Of course I'll clean my floor, it's my house. Not my wife doing it, I will be doing it. Accountable of what? 
you do. Being accountable of your body. Remember, you are the master of your own universe. The good news is you can make the difference. You want to get six pack, you can do it. Everybody can do it. Other people can't do it for you. You got to do it yourself. Not the best thing to hear, but that's the good news that I say is you are the leader of your body. Okay, so just do it. Stop overthinking. Just start training more often. Commit to it. Make it a habit. And it's not as hard as you think when you get a habit. One more round. So if you made it that far, carry on, right? Maybe you're a beginner, you made it that far, you're crazy beginners or intermediate. We still have one more round. But my request is, again, please do it with good form. No rush. Thank God my hair, my hair is still okay. Ah, but I'm sweating so much. <laughs> it's just that the sweat didn't reach the top of my head. My head, the sweat is around here. So on top is still dry. <laughs> Final round in the next one minute. Okay, in the next one minute. Let's go. Next. 
Take it slow, control. Land soft. Land soft. We are halfway there. One more. Next. Uh. Plank Q raise. Go. The tuck jump is killing me. You can't tell from here because I have a very strong poker face. Just for information, my body is not the strongest. The strongest is my expression. I've been training my body for about 10 years, but I've been training my poker face for about 34 years. All right, so that's me. 
I'm struggling. Tuck jump. When I'm doing, I'm okay. But after the exercise, after the tuck jump, is what really kicks in. It happens to everyone as well. When your training is pain. When you stop training, you have to give yourself about 30 seconds to catch up. And the feeling will come in later. Oh. Felt great. It's about one hour of training. I still feel spicy here in my diaphragm, in my stomach. I guess the food still haven't fully digested yet. But anyway, yep, that's uh, the hell of the workout today. Thank you for joining me. And like I said, it's a two-way thing. It's not just me pushing you, but you guys here motivates me to work out as well. So like as long as I'm still breathing, I will do my part. I'll do more of this video, live video. Uh, I can't promise you to go live every day, but I will try or else I will keep posting to keep you empowered, to power through your workout and you helping me also to power through my workout. So thank you very much guys and girls. Thank you. And uh, I really appreciate if you can, um, don't just follow this workout, just, just start working out. Because let me tell you something, it's really health is wealth. Yeah. 10 years ago, I don't, I don't really fancy this health is wealth. All I want to do, all I want is to look good. But as time catches, yes, I have to admit that I'm, I'm 30, right? Approaching 30, you can really feel the difference. And of course, down the road, 40, 50, 60, 70 year old, it will get harder and harder. But if you've been exercising, you have the advantage. You have the advantage, right? Comparing from my average, my age, I'm still pretty young inside, still pretty fit. I'm like 23 year old or even younger, right? So that's the beauty of exercising you don't necessarily have to push yourself that hard every day okay but once in a while yes you should challenge yourself but most of the time you just have to do it you just have to make time to work out because the only bad workout is not the slow one is not the the hard one the only bad workout is the one that you didn't do the only bad workout is the one that didn't happen so just get it done don't think so much the more you think, the more you will find excuses. And you will never get it done. Thank you very much, guys and girls. Really appreciate it. Thank you very much. I wish you all the best. And take care. See you next. Peace. Bye-bye.